information tonight. Walmart intends to sue the town of Plainfield and several fire departments following this massive warehouse fire earlier this year. In a court filing, Walmart accuses the agencies of making this fire worse and causing even more damage. CBS 4's Courtney Crown joins us now to explain Walmart's claims, how firefighters made that situation worse. Well, Bob, Walmart, its insurers and underwriters say firefighters' decisions to turn off certain systems caused the fire to grow. This tort claim notice filed this week is a first step in the legal process. Six months after this massive fire at the Walmart Distribution Center in Plainfield, Walmart and its insurers are considering suing the town of Plainfield and its fire territory. In a notice to the town of Plainfield and various fire departments, they say the commanding firefighters deactivated or disabled the fire suppression system and opened doors inside the facility, and that those actions allowed oxygen to further fuel the fire. Now, Walmart is seeking money for loss of property, inventory, and earnings among other things. We asked Hensley Legal Group PC, which is not connected to this case, to explain the general process of a notice of tort claim. What they have to do is they have to put the state actor or federal actor on notice of a potential claim. So they have to basically lay out what occurred, what the injuries are, and what they know to date with regards to treatment and medical bills. To note, no one was severely injured in this fire, but again, the property was a loss. The lawyer we spoke with explained the next steps in the process after the notice is filed. What they do oftentimes is they go back and they investigate the claim, and then they either acknowledge that there's a potential claim there or they deny it. And a lot of times they'll go ahead and deny it. If Walmart and its insurers want to move forward after hearing from Plainfield, they can file a complaint for damages, which starts the lawsuit. The town of Plainfield says it has received the tort claim notices and because of potential litigation, cannot talk about the specifics of the fire. It did send a statement that says in part, the town of Plainfield is proud of the heroic response by the Plainfield Fire Territory and the supporting services from all over central Indiana who risked their personal safety to protect lives. The ATF told me today it has not yet determined a cause of this fire. In the studio, Courtney Crown, CBS 4 News.